same with it just in the system and kind of taking over that middle linebacker role? Uh, well, I think he said it well. Um, you know, I am more comfortable uh, in the system. I mean, everything's coming a lot easier to me now, uh, playbook-wise and, you know, fundamentally and uh, just in that area. Um, it's kind of helped me uh, use my, you know, physical attributes, um, you know, to keep improving. What, when you look at film, Leonard Fournette and Derrick Henry, are, are they the same type of runner, or do they have different characteristics? I think they're pretty similar. Uh, they both run hard. Um, you know, they both... Uh, they're both great running backs. Um, you know, they both have you know really good teams backing them up, really good offensive linemen. Um, you know, I think they're both great running backs, and we're going to prepare them for him just like we did for uh, for Net, and we're going to try to uh, you know start come out this game pretty fast. No touchdowns in the fourth quarter. What is it about that final quarter for you? Uh, I guess it's just the kind of mentality we have here. You know, you know we'll bend sometimes, we're getting knocked down, but we're, we're not going to break. Um, you know, we don't really focus on where we are at the field and start panicking and doing something different. We just kind of lock down and say, all right, it's another set of downs, you know. We've been here a lot of, you know, a lot of times, you know, we're used to this. Let's buckle down and, you know, let's let's hold it to as many points as, or as little points as possible. Manny brought up an interesting point. He said Alabama likes to run towards the guy who least wants to tackle maybe. How unique is that? How often do you guys prepare for that? And is that just something they do or how many times have you seen that? Um, yeah, I mean, a lot of teams do that. Um, some teams... Uh, you know, that's not what shows up on the media a lot, but most teams like to cut back. Um, I mean, the smartest thing to do, think about it, is to, you know, run to the people that, you know, are on scholarship to cover passes, not, you know, tackle running backs. Um, so most coaches take advantage of that, and, you know, a good coach is going to take advantage of that, so we just have to prepare for it. How much has Gary Green's improvement over the season kind of helped you stay fresh out there on the field where he can play a little bit more? Yeah, I mean, Gary's getting a lot better. Um, you know, it's nice to have him come in and, uh, you know, share some playing time with them, me. You know, it's not, you know, it's no pressure on me to, you know, if I get hurt or if I have to worry about, you know, going too hard because I have to stay in. You know, it's nice to have a guy come in and sub in for you. You've been in his shoes before. Where, where is he maybe compared to where you were at at the same time? Yeah, yeah, I've definitely been in his shoes before. I mean, you know, with B Mac, uh, All American linebacker that I came in after. Um, you know, I had to, you know, be ready for when my number was called and, you know, go out there and make plays and, uh, you know, learn from him, learn from the older guys. And and, uh, and he's at that similar stage where he's learning. Um, he's getting better with his playbook and, you know, where he is as a defensive player. He's kind of learning, you know, more fundamental stuff and he's getting a lot better. What's the difference between going against a, maybe a normal size running back then seeing Derrick Henry coming through at 6'3"? Yeah, it's definitely different, you know, because normally running backs are, you know, Shorter than you, but when you see the, line, the ones that are you know the same height as you, it's it's different. But um, you know, we try not to focus too much on that. Uh, you know, we're we're gonna tackle the way we've been tackling, and uh, you know, use our fundamentals and uh, you know, gap it out. Not try to do anything too special, because um, that's when we start making mistakes. So we're just gonna keep doing what we're doing week by week. You see from their offensive line.